transmission that does rev matching for a driver. In layman's terms, that means matching the engine speed with the transmission during upshifts or downshifts. We wanted to um, take away um, just the layer of stress that's at the track, especially if you're a novice driver, um, mm -hmm. that you don't have to heel and toe because it's a very awkward mm -hmm. maneuver to do. You're trying to brake with one foot and blip the throttle uh, with the same foot. So what do experienced racers think of the new configuration? We rode with one to get some initial reaction. This particular technology is uh, pretty transparent. The driver won't notice the synchro rev match system at all. They, what they will notice is that this is one of the best manual transmissions on the market. For those who don't want to work with a clutch, there is now a 7-speed automatic available. With a slightly shorter wheelbase than the 350Z, the new car also delivers better handling with the center point literally under a driver's seat. This is very evident when the car is on the track. And in a break from the rest of the pack, the 370Z comes with enhanced Nissan design braking systems instead of Brembro's, which are assumed to be the gold standard in performance braking. Now, the Z car is not a volume seller for Nissan, but its presence in the market is a clear indication that the company and this kind of performance vehicle will be around for some time to come. This is Greg Morrison.